Hi, this is Starman. I'm about to give you a tour of my William Optics telescope setup. Hope you enjoy it. Right, here we've got the William Optics uh, telescope. It's a double telescope setup with a 110mm telescope on the left and a 66mm uh, telescope on the right. I use them both simultaneously to observe the stars and galaxies. What I love about this telescope is that it's got a very accurate mount. The mount is that little block in the middle which the telescope sits on top of. You can see on the right hand side that the whole telescope is counterweighted by these two large weights. This offsets the weight of the telescope on the other side and balances the whole setup out. So here you go, here's a little close up of these two uh, weights and I can slide those weights up or down to make micro adjustments and just balance the whole setup perfectly. Uh, here we've got the Skyscan hand controller. This is a nifty little device. It's got about a database of 30,000 or more objects and I can punch in a name of a planet or a star or a galaxy and the telescope will automatically slew towards that object and point right at it. So I don't have to think too much. Once I've got everything set up, and the telescope is pointing in the right direction, just tell it where to go and zoom, off it goes. Here's a close-up of the eyepiece holders. Um, I put the eyepieces into these little uh, diagonals which have got prisms inside it. We're going to move closely up to the focus wheel now, that gold-coloured knob, and that adjusts the focus of the telescope. Here are the rings. The telescope is actually mounted in these rings and held in place. And eventually this is the, the dew cap with the little gold uh, cover at the top and there's the larger one in the background there. We're going to take a top down look at the telescope here. You can see the distinctive swan symbol of William Optics on both telescopes there. On the left hand side there's a laser rangefinder. Uh, it's not really a rangefinder, it's more of a viewfinder and it projects a little laser a uh, dot, a red dot up onto a screen. You look up through that little screen up at the sky and you can accurately pinpoint the position the telescope is pointing in and this helps greatly to line up the telescope and get observing quickly. We're just taking a top-down look at the lenses now. This is the 110mm lens on the right and the smaller 66mm lens down at the bottom. There's actually two lenses on each telescope. Um, it's what's known as an airspace doublet. There's one lens at the front and one lens just behind it with a gap between them. And this really greatly helps in reducing the chromatic aberration, which is the false color that you get on refracting telescopes of this type. Anyway, there you go. There is a quick tour of my William Optics telescope setup. I use this in my back garden to observe the planets and the stars and it's a really, really beautiful piece of kit and a great pleasure to use. Hope you enjoyed the tour. This is Starman signing out.